Barry. Wow, it's an interesting name. Uh, it's a nickname because he's the third, Cooper Barrett the third, so his family calls him three. So what do people at work call you? Cooper, or Coop for short. Okay. You have any security experience? I did two years in Iraq with MPs. Really? It's about the best training you can get. I like the idea of hiring a veteran? Working in a hotel is a whole different ball game. You need to be discreet. You need to be polite to guests if they ask you any questions. Tell, uh, tell me what to do, and I'll do it. He'll be great at the job, I promise. Besides, he's cute, so he'd like brighten up the lobby. <laughs> okay. Besides your expert opinion, do you have any references? Since I got out of the service, I've just been pretty much knocking around, living off my pay. So what'd you do before that? I was a short order cook. And I flip a mean burger, but I don't think that's the kind of references you're looking for. But uh, I do have my uh, honorable discharge and sharpshooters medal. Okay. And how do you know Maxi? He's my friend Cheryl's brother. Is that someone that lives here in Port Charles? No, no, no. Cheryl is my friend from prep school, and Coop used to visit her all the time. They're really close. Maxie used to talk about uh, Port Charles all the time. Sounds like a nice place to live. So I'd be good at security work, so here I am. Okay, well, I'll give you a try. Thank you, sir. Since uh, Maxie works in the boutique, you'll be seeing each other at work every day, so uh, I suggest you keep your personal life at home. Not a problem. Oh, don't worry. I know what can happen when you let your personal feelings interfere with your job. Okay. I appreciate the opportunity, Mr. Jax. You bet. Okay. I'll well, take the job seriously. I'm sure you will. Thanks, Jax. He'll okay. be great. I promise. Hi. Hi. Uh, don't let me interrupt. <laughs> no, I'm, I'm leaving anyway. My prediction for the week, you and Patrick will be tighter than ever. Thank Bye. you. So, how was work today at the boutique? Good. Yeah? Well, your boss called and said that you didn't want to stick around to go over the inventory. Oh, well, we do it like twice a week, so I didn't think it was that big of a deal. Hmm. I know what's going on here. You do? Yeah, the furtive looks, blowing off work, noises coming from your bedroom. You have a boy hiding in there, don't you? You think I have a guy upstairs in my room when Matt could be home any minute? What, do you think I'm crazy? Come on, you can tell me. I'm not going to spill to Uncle Mac, I promise. Okay, you know, you and your shrink roommate were just talking about your boyfriend, so maybe you have guys on the brain, but there is no one in my room. I have sworn off men. That's good. That is a good choice. That's how I was when I was living in Paris. I was living alone. I was independent. I was happy. Well, relatively happy. Well, I guess I wasn't miserable. You know, I'm gonna I'm gonna go upstairs. That was a four-letter word. I mean, just when you think everything is going so right, something could go wrong. It's like, okay, then there's the whole Mars Venus thing where you're communicating on two totally different planets. Like when he says he likes the couch, you don't know if he actually does like the couch or if he's just trying to avoid the issue, which is you two living together. And then you wonder if he's happy. Then you wonder if you're happy. Then if you're wondering, then you're not really happy. You know what? You were saying. To be continued. Right. Hi. Hi. You told him my name was three. I'm sorry, but it just came out and no one suspected anything. Oh, yeah, Max, the head of security, he was one of the hostages. He knows that we all had numbers and that three was locked in the vault with you. Yeah, but I covered fine. Oh, yeah, until they pull out my service record and find out my name is Cooper Barrett, no the third. If they check, which they probably won't, you just say three's like a family nickname or something. You know, you had a bunch of cousins that were also named Cooper, so your grandparents called you three and then it kind of stuck. How do you come up with this stuff? I'm really good at thinking on my feet. Besides, if you leave now after Jax already gave you the job, then Max will definitely get suspicious. The only way to get away with this is just to let it play out. I don't know. I'm trying to help you, okay? Could you just trust me, please? all I've got for you. I will pay you back. I swear. Don't worry. I know where you work. I'm going to get a copy of my records and take them down to the Metro Court and finish up the employment stuff. And then I'm going to find a place to stay. Oh, you know what? You should try Kelly's. Rooms are cheap and clean and I'm there a lot. 
I'll see if they have any vacancies. Thanks again. You've been great. Well, you were actually pretty good company in that vault. If I had been stuck in there by myself, I might have gone a little crazy. I know what you mean. So good luck. See you later.